Did Well Taste Tour. Thank you for doing it. <laughs> no, 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 keep going. <laughs> Thank you for joining us on this episode. Oh. Apparently his balls are causing him issues. It's, All right. It's, well, I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have worn jeans because yeah. anytime I'm sitting in jeans, my balls get mushed in. I've had long balls. So they're already not going to retweet us five seconds into the video. <laughs> oh, oh, damn it. <laughs> this is the, De the Devil's Backbone Brewing Company, which I don't know if you've seen the video or not. I posted a video there. They have this over in England. It's very strange. Not this particular oh, one, but Devil's that? Backbone, the IPA they have in England. Very strange. <laughs> yeah, at Weatherspoon's Pubs over there. Anyway, this is the Devil's Backbone Brewing Company. Skull Crushing Ape, Schwarzweizen Doppelbach, so a dark wheat Doppelbach beer. 8% alcohol by volume, 8.0, and it's from the uh, Devil's Backbone Brewing Company in Lexington, Virginia. Oh yeah. Which is where we're in Lexington, Virginia. Mm. Mm, close. Okay. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Not even. Closer than most people that are watching, probably. Oh. We're in Virginia. That's true. You know what, Le you know what Le Lexington is famous for? No. Okay, good, me neither. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, I thought you were going to yeah, make up something. Up something. No, there was, there was civil war stuff that went on there, but I'm not exactly sure. Uh, yeah. Well, some kind of, there's famous for <laughs> some kind of civil war Lexington stuff. Lexington and Concord in Massachusetts. Yes, yeah, so I know about Lexington and Massachusetts. It was famous for the Revolutionary War. And I know that Appomattox Courthouse, which is near to Lexington, is where the civil war was surrendered. After that brief history yes. lesson. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yummy. Mm. That's good. Ah, I love it. Yummy. It's great. 8% mm -hmm. alcohol. Yeah, yeah exactly. Huh. And it's it got like that nice seem like it. wheat beer thing, but it's got the maltiness of the bock. It's, it's totally it's malty great. like a like a porter or bock time mm -hmm. style thing. Mm -hmm. But weedy. But yeah. but yeah, but weedy. Yeah. And what you what so it's different. What what you don't get with this with these type of beers in the wheat stuff, you don't get the overt like banana type thing. But you get the richness and the sweetness of it. Well, like she was surprised when I had her. Uh, just like I pop pop the top of it and said, "Hey, smell." And uh, she didn't think like once I poured it, she was shocked that it was done. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mean, I knew it would be dark just because it's Doppelbach, but or well, but schwa the, means well, black in German. Just oh, the okay, smell, yeah, though. Yeah. Sm to me, it smelled more like a wheat beer. Yeah. It so does. I was thinking it's gonna look a little bit more like a. Yeah, it just smell. Uh, it does smell more like a, a white, a vice beer, German yeah. vice beer. Yeah. Yeah. So then I, I, I love the combination. It doesn't then. smell malty, really. Yeah. Oh, well, as soon as I smelled it, I was like, Yeah, dude. Hmm. I don't really know. I mean, I never had it. Before. It, it does smell, I mean, it does smell a little different, but it's more yeah. wheat beer. It's definitely more wheat beer, I would say. Mm -hmm. It's part of their Trailblazer series, it looks like. Okay. I like this a lot. This is I really tasty. Like I was very, I don't even know about surprise, but I was very pleased. Because I kind of, I, I kind of got this one, it's kind of like, mm, I don't know. It was like the only thing in uh, Target that was even oh, yeah. decent sounding. That, that was back when it's pretty good product. Oh, exactly. So I saw that one. I was like, I gotta go with this one because they don't have the make your own, so I couldn't like mix and match yeah. them. And all the other ones were just kind of like it yeah. was like just stock standard yeah. stuff. The uh, the Devil's Backbone stuff over in England. I did find out this. They actually they get the recipe from the brewery here, but they uh -huh. actually brew it over uh -huh. there. Well, that's probably cost. Of course, yeah. I mean, God, to import that stuff. It's all in kegs and stuff, too, so. Right. For a company like a Guinness like, or one of the big, I mean, that's fine, but yeah, for. Right. Yeah, I, I love this stuff. It's really good. It's great. I'm going to give it an eight. I really like it. It's a very solid. I, there was one that was from Germany or Austria. We were talking about this earlier. I can't remember what it's called. There was one that was similar to this. This, I think, might even be better, but this is a really solid brew. Mm -hmm. Like, same style? Yeah. Yeah, I think like it's the dark, Like the dark wheat beer type thing. I think uh, eight and a half for me. This is right up my alley. That's what I'm gonna go with. Eight and a half. I gotta give it a nine. We just gotta get another organic chocolate stout now. Yeah. So because you drank all that four pack of that. Did, did you? Yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's, it's great. Really nine. Like <laughs> yeah. That's good. That's great. really really yeah. good. All right, so nine, eight and a half, mm -hmm. eight and a half. So two eight and a halves, an eight and a nine. Yep. All right. Anything else to add? No. Retweet us, man. Yeah, retweet Devil's us. Devil's Backbone. Devil's Backbone, Skull Crushing Ape. 
Schwarz Weizen Doppelbach. I like the picture too. The skull yeah. crushing ape is pretty cool. Yeah, it is. Uh, this is eight percent alcohol. We described it well enough for you. I don't know. Do we say that? I don't think there's yeah. much else that I can say about it. Banana. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, because it's yeah, just a little bit crushing. crushing yeah. something. There's some. It's nice anyway. Yeah. From Lexington, Virginia. A good eight marriage of malt and wheat. We'll be back at the tour. Thanks for joining us. Join us next time. Keep clicking.